Yo, what's up guys? This is RB on two wheels. So uh, today I'm going to be working on um, this bike here, Kawasaki Z650. So if you are remotely mechanically inclined, this is uh, Mechanical 101 by RB on two wheels. So let's get to it. I'm going to be uh, doing a couple of things. I'm going to be doing uh, oil change and also uh, as I'm working on it, I may also throw in um, a rubricate the chain. So uh, without further ado, let's see what we need to do this job. All right, so first uh, procedure, warm up the bike, take off the engine uh, oil uh, drain plug, uh, take off uh, oil filter, that is the procedure. And then um, the tools needed to do this job, uh, one, we need uh, a 17 millimeter socket with a wrench, Oil filter remover, 17 mil. Oil pan, gloves, fuel uh, funnel, uh, torque wrench, uh, PT, which is a uh, paper towel. Okay, materials needed for this job, we have oil, 1.9 quarts, uh, oil filter, uh, part number is uh, 16097-0008. And also, since I'm going to be lubricating my chain, I'm gonna need a uh, chain rope, okay? so. Without further ado, let's get to it. All right, now, step one, let us warm up the bike for about uh, maybe one minute. Step two, we're gonna remove uh, the bolt, which is located right here, under here. That's step two, but you're gonna need an extension. Also, our oil pan. So now we are done with uh, draining the oil. So what we're going to do next is we're going to remove the oil filter. Yeah, so when doing this, at least you need to get some bit uh, like a paper towel to put under here so that you don't mess up your uh, your exhaust, so that oil doesn't go on your exhaust. But since I'm gonna clean it, uh, uh, no big deal. So as uh, this one is draining up, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, uh, put back on the drain bolt uh, plug. And then um, after that, I'm going to install to, to, to put on a new oil filter. So now it's time to, to put back on the drain, uh, the drain bolt plug, but I'm going to reuse the ring because uh, it's still good so let's go ahead and do that uh, so this here is my torque uh, so I'm going to be using according to manufacturer specs it says uh, 22 to torque up this bolt here there you go That's good to go. All right, that's it for the drain bolt. So now we're gonna go uh, repress uh, the filter. This is the new filter here. But in order to install it on the bike, you need um, you need to put some oil a little bit on the ring. So I'm not going to use uh, any tools, I'm just going to do uh, a handy tight, that's it. Because I, I don't want it to be uh, tight. Just handy tight is enough, you don't need any tools. Now it's time to put in the oil and when that is done, we'll be good to go and do the chain.
let us start the bike and uh, uh, see where our oil level is so you see here right here uh, this is the oil uh, the oil window so if you want to see how much oil you have in you just go here and then um, check it so the bike was empty on oil so you have to make sure you run the bike a little bit so that the oil can be saturated everywhere and then you see how much you have in here by looking on the window here it also has the uh, the indicators here so now that's what I'm going to do I'm going to start the bike let it run for like uh, five seconds and then check the oil and see where my levels are but you make sure when you're doing this the bike has to be leveled Yeah, I don't know if you can see that, but yeah, that's where we need our oil. So we are now good to go. So now it's time to replicate the, uh, the chain. guys that's it for me and thanks for watching and if you haven't already please consider subscribing comment share like until then rb on two wheels is out peace